Hi, and happy World Ocean Day. I'm Mike, I'm a graduate student at the University of New Hampshire, and this is the UNH Coastal Marine Laboratory, where I'm working on some really exciting research. I'm working with the UNH College of Life Sciences and Agriculture, the UNH School of Marine Science and Ocean Engineering, and New Hampshire Sea Grant on a lumpfish aquaculture project. So first of all, what's a lumpfish? Well, I have a couple lumpfish friends right here. Pretty adorable, swimming around, um, and that's what they look like. Lumpfish like cold water, so you'll find them right here in the Gulf of Maine. They can grow to be fairly big, a little over a foot long, and they have pretty special fins that act as suction cups, so they can suction onto seaweed or rocks, and, uh, and they don't have to worry so much about swimming. Now, secondly, what is aquaculture? Aquaculture is essentially farming food or plants or animals from the water. So it could be fish or shrimp or seaweed, oysters, or really anything else people want to grow. Finally, why are we interested in lumpfish aquaculture? That's a great question. We don't eat lumpfish, but we do eat salmon. And farmers that raise salmon have a really big problem with parasitic sea lice. Sea lice hurt the salmon, they cost the farmers lots of money, and they're hard to get rid of. Now lumpfish are being raised and used as a cleaner fish, which means that lumpfish will actually eat the sea lice right off of the salmon. So the salmon get cleaned of parasites and the lumpfish get a meal. It's a pretty good deal. This method of dealing with sea lice is more sustainable than other strategies like using pesticides. And that's why people like me are really excited about lumpfish. So thanks for listening. Uh, have an awesome World Ocean Day celebration. Hope you learn a lot. And if you're interested in learning some more about lumpfish, uh, check out the PDF link by this video.